Hi friends, it's Chrissy here. So today we kicked off our Christmas and July sales of July 2021. And we're actually holding the sales three days this year on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday in our antique mall. But I just had to stop. This booth had this adorable little vintage ceramic elf shoe. And it looks like they put in a little um, Christmas tree and vintage Santa. And they're selling this for just $4. Isn't that amazing? I think that's so cute and so cheap. Um, and I love, because we're having the Christmas in July, I love that this vendor like took the time to actually bring in some Christmas stuff for the event. So I just wanted to um, show some of it off. They have a clock back here, which is modern, but it looks old. That is so cute. And look at this Santa. Isn't he adorable? I have, I don't know, the last couple years I just started, like, collecting vintage Santas. I'm not sure why, but I have been. Another one of my problems. So, uh, <laughs> anyway, I do love, love that. Look at this so cute I don't know it looks new but it's supposed to be old looking um, she sold several signs today that's how I knew she had Christmas look at this fun Christmas candy dish platter super super cool another Christmas Santa down there she just has oh my god look at this these Kawipi, um dolls look he's supposed to be a little elf how cute is that? I can't tell his the age of him. And look at this little guy. Oh my goodness, they are just too cute. Um, to, oh, so they're 2004. They're not super old, but they are so cute. While I'm here, I see this old thermometer with glass. That is so cute. Um, she has a little bit of everything that looks like a, what is that? A coat hanger with deer carved. She made several of these little Christmas dioramas out of stuff, which is super cute. Um, trying just to highlight her Christmas. Oh, she has a Christmas sign there. She has some artwork made from pictures from local, a balloon fest that we have nearby. Um, this is beautiful, this fabric. I don't even see the bumblebees on there. So she has Ma Bee checkered with bordered gold. Oh, a tablecloth, 60 by 120. Online, it looks like it was selling for 319 and she has 100 on it. This is a beautiful, um, let's see what she have. Quilt, only $45. There's a little snowman lantern, a piece of art window down here this is a beautiful uh sewing cabinet that she redid i think using transfers but that would be a great it's like for somebody like me that has way too much costume jewelry that's what i need for a jewelry box it's about two and a half foot tall yeah that's what i need and oh my gosh the little look at this a brand new do-it-yourself little ornament. That's so cute. Um, some fun Christmas. I love this vintage light. That's another one of my problems is I'm obsessed with vintage lighting. That is that is beautiful. I love that. I gotta find a place for something like that. Um, oops, sorry about my hand being there. Another Christmas sign. Here's an example of one of her dioramas. She must have them on timers because they were blinking. So she must have them set where she can turn them off and on. Some beautiful milk glass. This here, I love how she takes old photos and she paints them in modern frames and makes them look so cute. Great decor pieces. These are so, so cute. Big Kevin USA, those are so cute. Look at that vintage lampshade and clock down there. That is totally a boho mirror with their mirror. I love this. She took this old mirror 
And she put some, I guess, I don't know, decals or something on there. I don't know. She does amazing with this stuff. Look at this Santa cake pan. Oh, that's so cute and fun. I wish I baked. I don't. That's a lie. I really don't wish that I baked. I just enjoy the eating part. Some Pyrex. This is cute. This gigantic reindeer. I mean, he's probably two and a half foot that way and at least two foot this way. He's pretty good size. So, oh my gosh, he's so cute too. San Francisco, Japan, he is cute. Fire King. Little bit, another lampshade down there. So, oh my gosh, and these. Another thing I'm a sucker for is brass. And oh my gosh, my mom totally had this. I wonder if she still does. Because she don't give her to anything, so she should. But we used it all the time, so I wonder. But that is so cute. Here's a, another example of, I told you, her hot air balloon art. Um, that are from the actual balloon fest. And she has signs. I love this. This one definitely... Need to put that over there. Hopefully everyone in 2021 is going to be nice this year. And we're going to change the world um, one day at a time if everyone just starts being nice and kind to one another. So this is a really cool, I can't tell if it's old or not without taking it out of the frame, but that's really cool. Another one of her balloon fest. Oh no, this is different. These I think are Dixie Belle. I think transfers put onto a painting that she did. I love this. Warm friendship like the setting sun sheds kindly light on everyone. That is what we need more of in the world, people. So I just wanted to throw this. Oh, and check out this wood rocking chair. I guess she did. I don't know if these are Dixie Bell. I'm not sure. But she put this stuff on here. And then look at that. I don't know if you can see it. There we go. But it's a super nice rocking chair. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the Chris. The, the Chris. The Christmas quick tour of booth 32 for Christmas in July. Till next time, stay fabulous. Have a great day. And Frosty and I say, see you next year and next time. Bye.